Good morning and welcome to Personal Peaceful Growth Calendar Week 49. Good morning, Miss Deb Wayland. Good morning, Sue. How are you doing? Good. How are you? I'm great. It's Happy Thursday, you know? Yes. And we're back stateside. Yay! Yes, we are. Are we? <laughs> well, some of us are still recovering from jet lag, from extraordinary experiences in Australia. But, but what we... a great experience it was. Yes. You had a great time, didn't you, Miss Deb? Had a wonderful time. People were amazing, so friendly, so nice, so kind. The country, of course, it's in itself is just beautiful. The sights, wonderful. It was just amazing. Loved got, meeting so many new people. And you got to play with your koala bears. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. So those are good that's, things to be thinking about at 3 a.m., right? <laughs> that's true. Yeah, wake up at 3 a.m. and think of a furry beast. No. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, the, the other part of this that's interesting is um, we're talking about... What is our theme today? Being energized by the beauty and love that is flowing our way. Yeah. Yes. And you well, and I always talk about appreciating beauty around us, and we do find so much joy in that. We really do. Yes. And we went to Botanical Gardens, and we yep. went to the store. There were so many beautiful birds in Australia. We had such mm -hmm. a good time. So we, we were did. really beauty and we got to come back to snow and ice and another kind of beauty right miss deb yes <laughs> it was like it's a different kind of like culture shock it was weather shock <laughs> we were in 88 90 warm degrees you even reached 100 at one point and then you come back to even 40 felt cold <laughs> dead get out the long johns honey yes and yeah, today we are talking about getting energized. And the number one reason people have trouble getting fired up is the fact that they have trouble sleeping. So mm -hmm. we're going to suggest to you that before you go to sleep at night, you need to try some different oils. You need maybe take a couple of tries to relax really deeply. Perhaps you need some cedar wood. Cedar wood is excellent for a good sleep. Mm -hmm. Those are just about sleeping issues. Now, this mm -hmm. is our week to talk about making clear statements about I so love connecting with similar hearts through Mother Nature. Mm -hmm. Meaning, if you love to talk about flowers, you love to see pretty pictures, go to a museum, hang out there, wear a quiet scent. Let people find you at the museum. You'll have things in common. Visit botanical gardens and express gratitude for the deep, rich colors and the beauty. Even the big spiders. There were some really big spiders <laughs> that I expressed gratitude for in Australia because I could run faster than they could. Okay? <laughs> they were very cute and attractive, but they took one look at me and yelled, Here comes winter food. Let's get her. And I said, oh, no. it's oh. true. Yes. Anyway. Yeah, well, I was going to say that part of appreciating beauty is also appreciating the new adventures that you get to go on to find that beauty. It's just, it's amazing where you get to see it, different beaches, different parks, national parks, anywhere. Right. If you choose to look at every. Everything around you with gratitude, you will be amazed at how things look different. Mm -hmm. And sandalwood, cinnamon, and lavender are an amazing blend that can help open up your spirit of adventure and open up your willingness to be energized by the beauty around you. That's true. And we have some music to help you. I love this music.
I'm very big on dance it out, baby, dance it out because I love, I love pretending that I could play as fast as, as they do. <laughs> oh, that's, uh, Chopin is an advanced. Yes. <laughs> that's not just here. No, no, we won't be doing that at your um, recital. Honey. <laughs> <laughs> There's the kind of love where being around someone makes you feel energized. Just being around them gives you more energy than less. You've got to mm -hmm. remember who energizes you and who may need your energy because mm -hmm. everybody laughs at me about how i plan my schedule because when i'm working with clients i have a plan i can't mm -hmm. do four downers in a row no i cannot because mm -hmm. if you drag down that many times to try to pull people up you find yourself sitting in a pit so i always have to plan energy I plan, mm -hmm. yeah, I can talk to her and then him, and then a 15-minute break, and then I can talk to him and then talk, her. Talk, talk, talk. Yeah, well, I do the same thing when I schedule my clients, and you also know what types that, what times of the day that you're more energized. Like you and I, we're morning people. We're up and going, so we schedule a lot of our things for the morning because that's when we are feeling, um, you know, full of energy. Yep, and Simi Barkey will find very good for warming. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a um, lot of us use it for diabetes. It's an amazing gift for um, keeping your blood sugar levels even and even lowering them at some times. It helps your body use insulin better. So it's a great, great oil for that. Yes, and yes. you can look. And you can look. Nicole Stevens. Nicole Stevens. Okay. So I know you're on, but I can't hear you. No, I, no. I, oh, I, there you are. <laughs> echo, echo, echo. The choice, the choice, and something that nobody ever. Circumstance, circumstance can change. It's true. Yeah. You know, you and I both talk about friends that we have and they wake up just with that blue mood and, oh, it's going to be a horrible day. And it does set the precedent for the day. And when you wake up like, yay, I'm ready to begin. This is exciting. Your day is a total, just, it goes totally different. It's a happier, you know, welcoming of anything day. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> sandalwood. Okay. Sandalwood. Yay, sandalwood. Tell us. You know about where it. I love putting Tell that. I love putting that right on my on my forehead. It's I think it really makes a good connection. Yeah. It's indicated for a state it's of indicated for a state of and for worldly over it. Worldly over it. Tell them about this part, Deb. Tell them about this part, Deb. Yeah. Um, when we, you know, think too hard about specific outcomes that we want, especially out of like a neurotic need for security, um, sandalwood oil really helps to recenter us and make us accept reality as it is. It's very soothing. It's soothing on the mind. It really helps us rethink and become more aware of what our expectation should be. And it really opens up our creative source. Um, it really just allows us to be present here and now, which, you know, as Sue and I talk about, it's so important to live right now, not, you know, 10 weeks from now, a year from now, live in the here and now and appreciate all that. Okay. It helps with where, with where, if we're a little bit irritable too, it really does calm some of those aggressive tendencies, you know? Yes. Quality yeah. and beauty are gifts and beauty are gift to those who live according those who live according to so if you're at, so if you're at, and in gratitude, in gratitude you, get you, around you. Around you. Mm -hmm. you get more energy. You get more energy. Yeah. And we have to know that magical experiences are headed my way right now. 
and I'm fully ready to receive all of them. We have to be open to accepting all these new great experiences and appreciating the joy of Mother Nature. I get joy just looking at pictures like this, don't you? Yes, I love these. Yes, I love these. Yes. Okay. Really okay. important. Really important. Little season shift. Little season you shift. Your body. Your body. On Sunday and Monday, <laughs> we're Sunday and Monday. We're going to do the quarterly retire from sugar program. And mm -hmm. in the meantime, remember to make sure you have plenty of lifelong vitality, PB assist, and terrazyme on hand. And frankincense, orange, and fennel are excellent to use on your body, right in your mouth, right in your water, um, all day mm -hmm. long. And when we're having little obstacles in our lives, it's really important rather than dwell on, that was inconvenient. Oh, no, that was terrible. I am able to <laughs> digest everything going on around me. I am understanding mm -hmm. my lessons and trusting my own wisdom. And with mm -hmm. the personal peaceful growth calendar, there is tons of affirmations. You oh don't my, yes. Use those. You can make up your own. The idea is that you get to shift your thinking. You get to change how you feel about you in a better way. Right. Yeah, I just love this. Let us always meet each other with a smile, for the smile is the beginning of love. I mean, Mother Teresa, come on. Yes. And it just allows us to focus on all the good that's going on in our world and appreciate it. And, you know, a smile means so much. It makes the difference. Sue, you're the one that taught me. You just say hello to people, and it changes everything about them. Their whole You can watch the energy shift. It is just so amazing. Yeah, because a lot of people don't get acknowledged all day long. They just, mm -hmm. nobody says anything to them. They go on about their job. I said thank you to somebody who was cleaning a public restroom. When I was using the public restroom, I said, thank you for your efforts. It's appreciated. I thought the woman was going to cry. You know, it was mm -hmm. like, nobody must ever talk to this poor person. But I appreciated right. her efforts. Oh, I would too. You like clean bathrooms. Absolutely. Sure. Remember, love is the energizing elixir of the universe, the cause and effect of all harmonies. Yes. And it's not just loving others, it's loving ourselves as well, which we talk about is so important to love ourselves first. Yes. And a new day, be open enough to see opportunities, be wise enough to be grateful, be courageous enough to be happy. Mm -hmm. Sandalwood yeah. sitting in lavender again. Yay. This is a great one. I feel alive, energized, and motivated to do whatever it takes to achieve my goals. Woo! Right on. And Ollie was going to talk to us. Yeah, good old Ollie. He's telling everyone, he says, I will express and show my appreciation for others. Sandalwood is very nice for relaxation and for uplifting your mood, but it's important for our young children as well to understand how important it is to show gratitude, to say thank you, and to thank people for a job well done, even if it's mom and dad. Yeah. <laughs> you know, our artists had amazing pictures before we, <laughs> we had Da Vinci and now we have Van Gogh. <laughs> If you truly love nature, you will find beauty everywhere, even in those ooey gooey snails. <laughs> yes. I love feeling in touch with Mother Nature. Spending time outside, whether it's hiking, biking, walking on the beach. We did a lot of that. Or yeah. lying in the sun. It brings me clarity and energy. Yes, and remember, and as part of giving up sugar for three weeks starting on Monday, you're going to remember to do your two 20-minute walks to move the mm -hmm. old stuff out, folks. Move it on out. Give your body a rest. 
Yeah, and it's amazing cleanse. Good. <coughs> Excuse me. We often forget that we are nature. Nature is not something separate from us. So when we say that we have lost our connection to nature, we've lost a connection to ourselves. It's very yes. true. So say your affirmations, be happy with who you are, enjoy being energized, and we want you to have a great week. We have more webinars coming up. Keep checking our postings. And we love you guys. And yes. we are rolling, rolling, rolling. Thank you, Miss right. Deb, for getting up early and traveling to Wi-Fi after the storm. God bless you, dear. Yes. No problem. And everyone, get energized. Have a great, great day and a great weekend. Thank, Thank you, Sue. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.